Good morning, everybody. It's Brianna from Gym Fitness here in Atascadero. Uh, I think I'm just gonna wait a moment to see if anybody pops on before I begin speaking a whole lot. So actually, I have to wait a moment and see who is still doing these live classes. Good morning. It doesn't say who popped on. Oh, Davina, good morning. Hi. And Carly, nice to see you <laughs> virtually. Um, so Carly, this doesn't really pertain to you a whole lot because you're not here in Tascadero. But as our, hey, good morning. As um, y'all are finding out, the gyms around here have been ordered to close. So uh, Gym Fitness is now, um, we've got our doors closed, unfortunately, which is a big bummer. Good morning, Davina. Uh, we did everything that we could possibly do to, uh, you know, keep the place clean and to service all of our members. And if you've been here, if you've been around, I think you would all agree, Gym Fitness has always been super clean and sanitized and it, you probably couldn't believe that it could get cleaner, but it did. But unfortunately, we have to follow these rules. And so we are now closed temporarily. Hopefully it won't last long. Uh, yeah, it breaks our heart too. <laughs> um, that being said, classes were supposed to begin in August here in our Group X studio. We were all getting pretty excited for that and I was playing around with the schedule. I'm not sure that will be happening, but we're gonna, you know, just play it by ear. And so virtual classes, we have been doing these now for four months, primarily myself, Jess, and Anne, and we've had a wonderful few yoga instructors also volunteer. Um, four months now, virtual classes. As you can tell, some of them, we've been tapering down a little bit, but we've still been offering about three to four classes a week. Um, it's difficult to get instructors to wanna to come in here and go live in front of an audience. So if you have any recommendations for me to get more people in here to teach for you, let me know because we would love to keep providing you with content. And it's just not possible for the three of us instructors to fill the schedule and make that happen for everybody. So if you have recommendations and you wanna tell us how to make that happen, reach out to me privately and give me that, uh, that advice. All right, so this morning we have a cardio blast class, uh, 30 minutes. If you have a light set of weights for one of the exercises, go ahead and grab them. If you don't, that's totally cool because you could go without the weights. So let's go ahead and start with a nice jog and we'll get into the workout. Try to get you out, out of here by 7.30, but we might run over a little bit because I've been blabbing the whole time. All right, you ready? Let's do it. All right. So just start with your nice, easy warm-up, jog. We'll have uh, several different warm-up moves as we typically do. And then the workout, our cardio blast workout, is 10 exercises this morning. They're gonna be about 45 seconds in length with a 15 second break. From there, after we complete all 10, we'll take a little longer of a break and then we'll go through one more time. So you'll see each exercise twice, so that's it. All right, from here, let's go ahead and drive those knees up a bit higher. There you go. Um, another important thing to remember is that if we teach a virtual class and there aren't a whole lot of comments or likes, we start to think that maybe people aren't participating. So as much as I hate to beg, for comments and likes. It helps us as instructors know that you're here and you still need us. We need to feel needed. <laughs> Let's go ahead and move into butt kickers. There you go. Otherwise, our mind goes and starts to think you figured out a different plan, you're outside working out, found a different video, a different gym, or, you know, who knows? So comment and like, we appreciate it. All right, let's go ahead and move into jumping jacks. Your other option, tap out that heel. Nice job. Keep it going. Well, I hope everybody is having a good week. 
my children have swimmer's ear. So that's been great. <laughs> Some sarcasm there. All right. Go ahead and go back to your jog. We're going to go through our warm up one more time. And then we'll get into the hard work. Are we ready? Get those knees up higher. Nice job. Keep it up. If you can get those knees to drive up as high as possible, that's good. Or take it lower. And as a reminder, if you've been with me for so long, I just kind of forget to give you options. You can always march here. A little too late now, time for butt kickers. Another option for butt kickers, side to side, driving those heels up. There you go. But you all know, the harder you work, the better it's going to be for your body. All right, jumping jacks. There you go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and last one. Awesome. Let's go ahead and reach. Reach for those toes, opposite hand to foot. A few more. There we go, last one. And then reach on over to the side, other side, back and forth. There you go. Okay. Let's go ahead and get into our workout. Are we ready? Good morning, everybody. Are you all on here today because the gym is closed? Thanks for showing up. Okay, let's go ahead and start. 45 seconds. We have toe taps. So I'm going to go and start my timer, and then I will get into it and show you what that's going to look like. Right here, no, without spinning around, I'm just demonstrating a side view. Go ahead and hop on into this. We're going to bring those toes up. Imagining that maybe there's a soccer ball there that you're tapping, or a box, something. All right, your knees are coming up, and you are using your imagination to tap your toes against something. They are coming forward. Good. Got 10 more seconds here, then we'll take a break. And our next exercise is where we will utilize that set of dumbbells. Rest. Now, if you missed it in the beginning, if you have a set of dumbbells, now is our time to use it. But it's optional. So, you could go back to jumping jacks here for our next 45 seconds or prison jacks. Are we ready? Let's go. Weight to the shoulders. We're going to hop out, bring the weights overhead. Nice fluid motion. Option. Tap that heel. Good. Remember, everything is 45 seconds here with a 15 second break. Halfway, keep it up. I see some comments coming in. I'll hop on over there in just a moment and check. Good work, come on. 10 seconds left. Keep it up. Three, two, one, to demonstrate the next exercise, long jump, gonna hop forward, shuffle it back, side view, forward, try to land light, shuffle back. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. Oh, thank you, Katie. I forgot to put my hair up. I suppose I could, but it feels good. All right, I hope we're doing those long jumps. Shuffle it back, forward, and back. You got 25 seconds left. Nice job. Now, if we're not long jumping, we can take a squat here, right here, wide one. That's your option. 10 more seconds. Keep it going. Five, four, three, two, and one. Our fourth out of 10 exercises is a plank. Any that you choose. 
I'm going to take mine to the forearms. You can sway the hips, drop the knees, whatever you want to do. Ready? And go. So go ahead, come on down. Maybe you're in a high plank, but I'll warn you our next exercise, mountain climber. So we'll be in a high plank for that. So just make sure shoulders are over those elbows. Curl those hips under. Engage the core. You're halfway. We're trying to create a long line from the crown of our head down to our heels. Nice job. Keep it up. You've got 10 seconds to go. Breathe through it. You've got five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, you can go ahead and stay down there. We have mountain climbers here. So you're going to get into that high plank position. Drive those knees forward. We ready? Let's go. Right here. Again, shoulders over those wrists. Fingertips pointed forward. Drive those knees in. If you want, you can twist those knees. This is your workout. You decide how you want to do it. Keep it up. You're halfway there. Engage that core, that tummy. Keep it tight. 15 seconds. After this, we'll go ahead and come on up. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! If at any point you need to sneak in some water, go ahead and grab your water. All right? Nice job. Keep it up. Next one. We have quick feet right there. Ready? Let's go. So, upright, still, similar to those taps, only feet stay in, just tap the ground, right here. I think we see this a lot in football, as a warm up, just let it all shake, all right? I'm sure no one's watching, maybe just all your kids, just let them participate with you. 15 more seconds. Keep it going. Whew. I'm starting to warm up here. The sweat is starting to drip. Three, two, one. Break. All right. Low lunge drivers. We're going to split our time in half here. We're going to come low. Drive that knee. You ready? Side view. Let's go. Pick one side and then get your body low because you are engaging that quad and that glute here on the stable leg. Keep going. Go for seven seconds more and then we switch sides and switch. Get right into it. There you go, team. You've got this. Middle of July, we've been here with you for four months. We gotta keep on pushing through on these workouts. Three, two, and one. Give your body a quick break. Three more. Three more, and they are all kind of intense. Let's keep going. We're gonna have an exercise right here. Let's go. Where we come down and up. Switch to the other side. Cross jacks. Good job. Come on. 30 seconds to go. Keep on pushing it. Woo. Awesome. Come on. You've got 20 seconds left. Got to give it your all. The only way change happens is if you do something different. If you push a little harder, you eat healthier. Come on, three, two, one. Okay, two more, and then we run it through one more time. Next one, side to side hops. Three, two, one. Let's go. Right here. Pretty simple. Now for not hopping. Right here. Fast movement. Side to side. You can still get that heart rate up a bit. I think 
on each. Three, two, and one. And wouldn't it be awesome? Our last exercise here was, what do you all want? I can't hear you. Burpees, right? All right, time has started. You can do full burpees or let me demonstrate a couple options. Come right here, step out, step in, or a little more impact, hop it back, hop it forward. I call these plank up, because we are planking out. Now our time is already halfway. Hopefully you're doing something, maybe those burpees. Burpees, we come all the way down, and all the way up, and hop at the end. So we've got 10 seconds left. Then we'll take a proper break and start over. Three, two, and one. Awesome job, okay. Perfect timing. We are gonna go through one more time. Go ahead, grab a sip of water. Nice job. Good morning, everybody. Okay, you know what's so weird? Is there were like 10 people watching, don't know how many people were participating, and then when I said burpees, it went down to two. So who is still committed? I'm gonna guess Carly's still here because Carly is a strong woman and she doesn't give up or she's gonna come back later. I can guarantee one of those things. All right, don't let those burpees scare you off. Okay, starting again. One more time through. Are we ready? Yes, and man, Carly, I love you. You are our biggest fan and you're not even a Kid Fitness member. So amazing. All right, let's go. Toe tap. Going through. One time from here. Total of two times. This is our last time. That makes sense. All right. Keep it going. Nice. Work, 30 more seconds. Woo, got it. Come on, 20 seconds to go. And then we got prison jacks. Keep it up. How we feeling, Carly? Come on, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, grab your dumbbells. We have prison jacks or jumping jacks, no dumbbells. Five seconds. Three, two, one, let's go. Right here, again, tap it out. Good job. Come on, you gotta push on through. 30 seconds to go. And then we got long jumps. Come on. Woo! It's getting hot up in here. 15 seconds left, team. Don't quit. You gotta keep on keeping on. 
me up. And that'll get us halfway through this round. Are we ready? I kind of found that the mountain climbers were the hardest thing this time. All right, let's go. No time to waste. Drive those knees in. Come on. You choose the intensity. If I had a whole lot of energy, I would be driving those knees in. Truth is, I'm tired today.
options for 45 seconds. You're going to choose one. You're going to push. Time starts right now. Let's go. Drop it. Bring it up. Our last exercise. I can promise you that. Come on. Less than 30 seconds to go. How's that heart rate? Is it just 15 seconds? Keep it going. 10. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ding, ding, ding. Boom. You did it. Let's go ahead. Come on down. Just take a moment. Let that heart rate come down a bit. We'll spend a couple minutes stretching and get you out. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead, take a seat here. Take one leg straight. The other leg is gonna come over. I'm gonna hug that knee right here. You can feel this stretch down into that glute. Feels so good. Now, if you finished this workout and you know you gotta go straight into some weights or you're gonna take a run outside, you can skip this part if you promise to come back later on your own and stretch out. Let's switch sides. Very important to get a good stretch at the end of your workout. But I know that some of you, you like to do more than 30 minutes. So go on and get it. Take care of that body and stretch it out when you're done. All right, let's go ahead. Lengthen both legs. Inhale the breath. Exhale and forward. Fold. You can feel this into the hamstrings. Feels so good. I hope you all enjoyed your workout. If you missed the beginning of my video, spent several minutes talking about the gym being closed and our virtual classes. All right, let's go ahead, come on up. Our plan was to end classes the end of July and start classes in person. That being said, I don't know what that looks like right now. I'm not sure that anybody really knows what that looks like, but I don't think I can come in here every day and provide a virtual class for my sanity because I have stuff going on at home too. All right, switch. But I am gonna keep trying to push out more content Hopefully with your participation and your comments and likes, it will encourage some of our, um, our, our people, our trainers, our group X instructors to come in here and teach for you. Let's go ahead and reach over to the side. Inhale the breath, come on up. Exhale, reach to the other side. Good. On your next inhale, go ahead and rise up. Exhale, forward fold. Release that head and that neck. And slowly round the back and rise up. Let's do a gentle little twist right here. And then we'll go ahead and take some swimmer's arms. Good. Forward and back. <laughs> you're welcome, Carly. I can do it because you're here with me and I feel all your love and support. So without you, I don't think I'd have the energy that I have. <laughs> Uh, in fact, I've actually noticed that. You weren't there with me last time, and I just didn't feel the energy. So no pressure or anything, but I love when you come here. You help me. All right. Thank you all for joining, whether you joined live or you're going to join later. Again, comment that you're here. Uh, leave a, just like it, something to let us know that we're still engaging you and that you're still participating. The more, the merrier. All right. Have a great week. Um, I haven't written a schedule for next week, so stay tuned. I'll probably post something on Sunday. I'm gonna be out of town for a little bit, so I don't know what next week looks like. So thank you. Just remember, we've been doing this for four months, so you can go back. We have probably 50 to 70 workout videos now for you to pick from, so please enjoy.
enjoy those videos. Go back and do your favorites. Um, thank you, and we will see you next time.